You are not a Jedi yet. It was a time of great competition in the galaxy. An uneasy state of peace had been established between the weakened forces of the Galactic Empire and the growing Rebel Alliance. I'm not afraid. Luke, if you only knew the power of the dark side. During this uncertain period of truce, the old adversaries decided to settle their differences not with blasters, lightsabers or death stars, but through the ancient, eternal game of... I witness the fire power in this fully armed and operational battle station. Chess. While following the classic rules of chess, players were able to play either as the rebel forces or the dark side. The pieces on the board were portrayed by characters which matched the rank of the chess piece. For the rebel forces, Luke Skywalker was the king, Princess Leia the queen, C-3PO the bishop, Chewbacca a knight, Yoda the rook and R2-D2 a pawn. For the dark side, Emperor Palpatine was king, Darth Vader the queen, Boba Fett the bishop, Tusken Raiders were the knights, ATSTs the rooks and the stormtroopers functioned as the pawns. When one chess piece took an opposing one, a brief battle scene showed the character defeating the opponent. Your feeble efforts are pointless. Star Wars Chess released for MS-DOS, Windows and Sega Mega CD. Next to that, the game can be found in the Computer Gaming's World's Worst Games of All Time rankings. This doesn't mean this is a disastrous game of chess. It's just not a good Star Wars title. Oh dear!